Anyway, it's a party, and I want the whole family there. We're having a party? No. Well, I'm sorry if I don't want you doing one of your stupid puppet shows. I did that once, Mom. And a lot of people thought it was pretty cool. In an effort to hip up his act, Job had briefly introduced a puppet. Can I tell you something, my man? Sharp Franklin, you are one cool <laughs> Speaking of mothers, let me give that oatmeal some brown sugar. Oh, my wife, you bastard! Oh, man, what's the matter with Franklin you? said some things Whitey just wasn't ready to hear. But, Job, weren't you also mercilessly beaten outside of a club in Torrance for that act? He also said some things that African-American he wasn't ready to hear either. You know, Mom, we have no idea where Dad is. How's he gonna hear about the party? Why do you have the baby monitor out? I'm, uh, listening She wants her man back. Yo, man, you're gonna get your sorry white ass thrown in jail. I said that's enough. Meanwhile, Job went to check on the one friend who didn't mind having him around. Get your loser hand out of my ass. George Sr. had just been picked up by his son. Great, it's stuck. All right, just stay down and let me handle this. Is that Mr. Bluth there? He's got us, Dad. Come on out. He's talking to you, you idiot. Cover. Hey, your daddy! How's it going, brother? You want to pop the trunk and roll the windows down, please? <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Hey, Franklin, how you doing, little man? <laughs> How do we get her to the church? To tell her you're in here? Or, oh no, cover her eyes and take her to the limo. No, you bring her in here, you knock her out with this ether, and you stuff her into this garment bag. Anyone sees you do the same. Oh, hi, Tobias. Uh, whenever I get a wee bit scared, I hum a little tune. Hum -de -de -de, hum -de -de. You put a handkerchief over her mouth for a couple of seconds. No more than two, though, because you could kill her. I don't have a handkerchief. Fine. Put the ether on the puppet's lips. Have the puppet kiss her. I ain't kissing that old bitch. That's my wife, you bastard. Dad, that's my wrist. Oh. Hey, man, that's his neck. What's so important that you're dragging me away from this miserable party? Well, I just had an old friend who wanted to tell you how much I miss you. Oh, who let this little black <laughs> Hey, brother. Who you calling brother, you hook ass? Brother! What the hell kind of puppet does Buster have on his team? Just let me think. God, Franklin, your breath. Oh, God. The police had been delayed when they thought they'd cornered a kidnapping suspect. Put your hands up, or we'll take that as a sign of aggression against us. They're not up! He's aggressive! Buster gets a hook replacement. You're not gonna let you in at the country club with that. I don't want no part of your tight ass country club, you freak bitch! Well, why don't you get Job to do your dirty work for you? Shall I knock Dad out and chain him to a pipe somewhere? Or should I risk another herpes outbreak with Kitty? Which is it this time, Michael? Well, definitely not one of those two things, but are you upset about something, Joe? How about the fact that I made you a thank you gift last week about which you haven't said word one? Come on, you asked me for $5,000 so that you can invest in a Franklin CD. Now, I assumed that you were talking about the mutual fund and not a compact disc of you singing to your hand. Job had recently made a recording of his ventriloquism act. Franklin comes alive. He Take hoped it would break down racial barriers and maybe be a crossover hit. It ain't hit. easy being white. It ain't easy being brown. All this pressure to be bright. I got children all over town. Sometimes, hey, where'd the guy go? I tried to express something to you in a couple of those numbers. And maybe, just maybe, heal this country a little bit. Dad? Right. You remember Franklin? Hey, Franklin. My man, how about some time? Uh -oh. But Franklin didn't want a kiss at all. Job had soaked the puppet's mouth in ether. Michael had received a witness list for his father's upcoming trial. He's on the list, any blabbers? Well, they've got one guy who won't be talking. That is, unless there's a hand inside of him. Oh, please, Michael, even then I wouldn't say anything. It's reassuring, but I was referring to Job's puppet, Franklin. Yes! I got him in the system! You did this on purpose. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he is re-dyed, rested, and ready to work. That'd be a good way to get some press. Oh, I gotta tell Franklin. I think he meant get Franklin. Am I on the list? 
We all are. Franklin, guess what? They've put an N Bluth on the witness list. Oh, that doesn't stand for what I think it stands for. Whoa, I did not say that. You did, Joe. Your mouth moved, your hand didn't. Oh, well, I should work on that. Look at this. My name is Judge. I didn't even know that this kind of technology existed. I could use this in my ventriloquism act. They have a bar here? Busy? Actually, I'm usually. Check this out, my lips don't move. He'll call me up in the stand, say something like, who is this little friend? And he'll say, my name is Judge. Whose name is Judge? My name is. OK. That's a silly name. That's enough. Judge. My name. Yes, I am judging your name. It am silly. Is. Please stop. Oh, now you're correcting my grammar? Joe, I'm not going to put Franklin on the stand, and, and your lips are moving just a little bit. Judge. He's right. His name is Judge now. You know, I think Dad might actually have a case here. I mean, I am concerned about this N. Bluth, but if it is indeed just a ploy on their part, then the only bombshell that they've got is a blueprint of an Iraqi model home, the same blueprint as ours, with no record that we actually got paid for it, although this is strange. Looks like there's a secret room in this one up the hallway. I wonder if we've got that. I'm gonna go check that out. OK, and we're going to go back to the hospital. Yeah, good. Check on, Buster. We do need to stick together as a family on this. Ash is going to go swipe some more talking magazines, but I'll make sure to poke the head in. Bye. <laughs> so have fun out there, because this is the last time you're going to see this side of a courtroom till your second wife divorces your freckled ass. Look at that. You just blew your wedding speech. I'd like to jump right ahead to calling a surprise witness. Only witnesses on the list? Oh, he's on the list. I would like to call to the stand Franklin Delano Bluth. Franklin? You're calling Franklin, Mikey? I sure am, pal. I support my brother. It ain't easy to be white. It ain't easy to be brown. You're my bro. Not my brother. Your Honor, this is highly unusual. Well, I'm very curious to see where this is going. I'm going to allow it. But I'm warning you, Mr. Bluth, this better make for a good promo. I was approached by the real prosecution recently and was asked if I would be willing to turn on my family and save myself. Would you please press the play button on the tape recorder inside the puppet? If you don't do it, we're going to go after N. Bluth, and we think that's you. You're asking me to conspire against my own client. Didn't you go to jail Why for would there have to be puppets like Frank? Think about it, Michael. Well, it looks like we've got a mistrial. But on the plus side, we've also got a hung jury. Hit it! Mock trial with Jay Reinhold! Mock trial with Jay Reinhold leads to imitating. All rise, but court is now in session. Please be seated. Not to see when you got someone's hand up your ass. All right, let's lose the puppet. I really need to see you. Yeah, I, I really, really want to see you too. There's something we need to talk about. I've always been mildly attracted to you. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, let's face it. There's no denying that there's a heat between us. Uh, I deny. I'd like to deny that. I know you feel it too. This mm -hmm. burning desire? I, 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 don't, I don't feel anything. I, I feel a, a burning mutual respect. I've got an outfit that's going to turn that respect into something fun. Respect is fun, Nelly. Uh, you know, you're going to want the respect when you hear what I... Where is the light? Don't touch that light. What? This is what happens when you steal from Frank's stable without paying. You want to be her pimp, you got to sit up with me. Him? You mean that, that she's a... Lady of the evening, working girl. She turns illusions from money. And that's when Michael recognized the voice. Tricks. Wait a minute. Don't you do it. Ain't nobody going to see a Frank look like. Franklin is Frank? Mr. F. Michael had just discovered that his brother was the pimp for the woman he thought was his what sister. What is going on? Nellie is, is not a, a prostitute? Of course she is. Oh, but I can see what the misunderstanding is. You didn't know. Maybe we can give him a family discount. Family discount is right, Job. This is the sister that I've been talking about. Maybe I should have been getting a family raid. Oh, my God. How do you know her? Met up with her after a show. And you did things with her? He didn't. I did. Well, if you consider crying like a girl doing something. I just want my brother to respect me, you know? I mean, I don't even have a job. Look, I could use a man's voice on the phone, and I like your little puppet show. Ain't so little when I take my pants off, lady. You've ruined the act, Joe. 